had a few messages today uh, and yesterday about how to lose fat. Now, you've there's a, there's a few things we're going to discuss in the topic. For example, you've got a calorie uh, caloric deficit and a caloric surplus. So the surplus is say an average human should be consuming 2,000 calories in a day. Uh, anything above that is a surplus, so you're actually going to be gaining uh, more weight. You're going to add mass to yourself, uh, which can potentially be more fat, but well, that comes along with it, but uh, more room for muscle development and growth. Now, if you're on a um, deficit, that's where you're going to be eating under 2,000 calories, uh, which will basically give you fat loss uh, that's what happens when you, you eat under the the amount of calories you're supposed to be consuming you will uh, lose fat so what I'm advising you guys is say you need to, each body each frame is individually different you're all different we're all human we're all we're all different so let's just say for example your calorie intake is 2000 and you want to be losing fat you want to be realistically lose uh, losing about 500 calories from your daily uh, intake of food. Um, now, the best there's two two ways of going through this is either eating 1,500 calories straight up um, and just doing it just doing it like that, or eating 2,000 calories and then learning uh, then, then burning the 500 calories through gym and cardio, etc. Now, for different people as well, you're going to be. Uh, we'll, we'll get on this topic another time. Actually, I'll I'll just stick to this for now. But um, basically, that that is the end and all. Um, to lose weight, minus um, minus the calories you're consuming. Try to avoid the carbs uh, and the complex carbs. You want your proteins, um, fats. Is at the end of the day, if you're if you're eating. It's not going to be beneficial for you, but if you're eating a pizza, let's say, and then you're eating a couple of slices of pizzas a day, this is just for example, you eat a few burgers, a few like a McDonald's and a, a pizza, um, and then that brings you to 2,000 calories, and then you burn the 500 calories, fair enough, you're still technically going to be losing fat, but it's not the healthiest way for you. So I will be doing like diet plans uh, and other stuff, good, great food that you can be eating, uh, not boring chicken, rice and broccoli, um, you've you've got it. You've got you've not. You can't see it as a diet, okay? You've got to see it as a lifelong. Uh, it's, 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 a, it's a lifelong journey. It's not something that's going to happen overnight. So what you want to be saying to yourself is, can you be consuming? Are you happy to be consuming this for the rest of your life? Because that is technically what you want to be doing. You don't want to be um, get getting to your your physique you want and then eating pizzas again. It doesn't work like that. Um, or if it does, it's, that's just stupid. <laughs> so really, realistically, you want to. This is want to be a life changing thing for yourself. Uh, like lifestyle, healthier food that you could be consuming. You'll feel you'll have more energy. Um, so that'll be a thumbs up for that. So basically, yeah, keeping it sweet. Five hundred calories under your average uh, calories you should be intaking during the day, uh, and then over time you'll slowly lose weight uh, and fat loss another key thing this is just a little key tip i'm going to give you yourselves if you're drinking guys beer come on you're getting a beer belly for a reason it's beer take that out of your diet two three weeks you're going to see a huge difference huge difference just don't have a drink for two three weeks i promise you you will see huge gains huge gains so for now guys uh keep it sweet take care guys